Hey guys in this video we're gonna be checking out the top 5 best pellet smoker for the money, that are available on the market for their true quality. I made this list based in my personal opinion and hours of research and have listed them based on popularity, quality, price, durability, user opinions and more. If you want to see more information in the updated price you can check out the description below and also make sure subscribe for more reviews. Okay so let's get started with the video. Starting at number 5, we have the Rectech RT1100 flagship. Let's start by saying that unlike some of the pellet smokers on this list, the Rectech flagship RT1100 isn't cheap. But, you simply will not find any smoker that's more value-packed than this one. Every component of the RT1100 is premium. From the stainless steel body, to the stainless steel grates, firepot, smokestack cap, and drip trays, to the 300-year ceramic ignition system, PID temperature controller, Wi-Fi, and, the list just goes on and on. Rectech have built this smoker to last long enough for you kids to hand down to their kids. It smokes, it grills, it sears, it bakes and it even dehydrates too. And, with 1,100 square inches of cooking space plus a huge 40-pound hopper, you're getting a heap of value per square inch of this model. And, the performance is top-notch. The PID-based temperature controller keeps the heat inside super steady. In our testing, the Rectech flagship didn't get more than about 10 degrees Fahrenheit over or under its target throughout really long smokes. The smoke it produces is really great quality. Plus, there's a low setting you can use to pump out more of the good stuff if you're after a stronger smoke boost for that bit of extra flavor. Set to low, the smoke output is impressive. But, one other area where the Rectech flagship really stands out from the crowd as well as in its higher temperature range. Personally, we're not that into trying to grill on most pellet smokers. It does work but it's a bit like trying to grill in a really hot oven. But, the Rectech flagship gets up to 700 degrees Fahrenheit which is a lot hotter than most so you've got a really high heat to play with. It's still indirect. And, we will warn you, above that 500 degrees Fahrenheit mark. You can't select the temperature, it's just a single full setting. But, the whole grill heats up that much hotter for better grill marks and a faster steak. We do rate it and absolutely don't feel the need to have a gas grill by its side with this pellet smoker. Moving on at number 4, we have the Z-Grill's 7052B Wood Pellet Grill and Smoker. This smoker, the Z-Grill's Multitasker, is similar to the more expensive Traeger Ironwood range, but comes in at a fraction of the price. There's features galore in what's not as good a quality but still decent package that most importantly, performs really well. I love this smoker. It's got pretty much everything that could be handy without the exorbitant price tag. Full body insulation coupled with the Z Grill's upgraded PID temperature controller keeps the heat super steady inside. There's a gasket that runs the full length of the door too, so nothing leaks out. All of the heat and smoke is going to your food. With the insulation, we noticed a significant boost in fuel efficiency compared to uninsulated pellet smokers when using the multitasker in cold but not freezing conditions. And, keeping those running costs down is always appreciated. For those of you who like a stronger smoked flavor, there's the popular super smoke mode which produces a noticeable boost in smoke production. But, super smoked or not, the food off of the Z Grill's multitasker really does rival that of a much more expensive smoker. Moist and tender with a nice thick smoke ring and good bark, no one's going to be complaining. Hook up the two included meat probes directly into the control panel. Or, view your progress, ambient temperature, and make adjustments from the Z Grill's Wi Fi app on your smartphone. The app isn't our favorite. We haven't personally experienced any connectivity issues, it's been just fine. And, it's got all the basics you need but the app is just pretty basic. I guess it's reflective of a smaller company who's put less into its development. But hey, it works just fine. At number 3, we have the Camp Chef Woodwind 24 Pellet Grill. For better grilling than you'll get on the average pellet smoker, there's the Camp Chef Woodwind with its awesome slide and grill heat deflector plate. On this pellet smoker, you don't have the usual indirect high heat to try to sear a steak on. 
Instead, simply slide the heat deflector open to give you access to the pellet fire underneath for hotter temperatures and that unbeatable flavor you get from open flame cooking. One thing to be aware of if you're buying this one for grilling though is that you don't have open flame grilling over the entire bottom rack. The firebox is relatively small and only gives you enough space to sear up about four decently sized steaks at a time. Still, if I wanted to be able to grill as much as smoke, this would definitely be my pick. Not included in the base price but still available for the Camp Chef Woodwind is also a propane side burner, giving you another convenient method of grilling. It's a cheap way to get add propane grilling to your backyard without having multiple barbecues set out and works as well as you'd expect. This smoker is very well built with some, although not as many as the Rectex, stainless steel components for added durability. There's a full color screen and Wi-Fi for remote control, plus Camp Chef's awesome external fire pot that lets you empty it without taking the grates and heat deflector out. Camp Chef's the only brand of pellet smoker that let you set how much smoke you like separately. Choose one or another low number for a lighter smoke profile or pump it up to 10 for heavier smoke and more flavor. At number 2, we have the Z Grills flagship 700D3 pellet grill smoker. If you're looking for the best pellet smoker for the money, and you want to keep that money very low, the Z Grills Multitasker has been one of my most reliable workhorses for years now. This smoker is cheap, has everything you need to smoke great food, and is of respectable quality too. There's nothing too fancy about the Z Grills flagship. Inside you've got a decent 697 square inches of cooking space split over two racks. There's a PID temperature controller which does a good job of keeping the heat fairly steady throughout your cook. And, there's dual wall insulation for improved fuel efficiency, particularly in cold weather. The quality isn't as good as you'd get by going Rectech or a more expensive brand like Traeger. But, the pieces all fit together well and the steel handles the heat well. The only quality-based complaint we have is that the included cover doesn't last that long. Out in the rain and full sun, ours didn't even make it through a year before fading and ripping over the sharp hopper corner which was then the end of it. We replaced it with a generic brand's one over time. The built-in storage cabinet is a handy feature that you don't get with other brands. We store spare pellets and barbecue tools in ours and like how clean it looks. They're also that much more out of the weather. Included in the price you also get two wired meat probes that plug directly into the control panel so you can cook your meat perfectly the temp without having to buy a separate unit. And finally at number one, we have the Chimp Tailgater Wi-Fi Wood Pellet Grill. This pellet smoker is technically a portable one but, it's strong and sturdy and there's absolutely no reason why it shouldn't be used as a regular backyard barbecue. In fact, for individuals, couples, smaller families, or really anyone who just doesn't want to have to smoke up half a cow to feel they're not wasting pellets heating space they're not using, the size of the Grilla Grills Chimp is pretty spot on. And, because you're going that much smaller, you're getting a great value for money pellet smoker that's every bit as good a quality as it performs. So, why the chimp? Like Rectech, Grilla Grills focus on giving you as good a quality as possible so there's a lot of stainless that's gone into producing this smoker. It's insulated with what Grilla Grills coined their thermal metal jacket for better fuel efficiency year-round. And, the seams are all welded, powder-coated, and cocked for better weather production. The construction is really up there and particularly impressive for the price. Aside from how well built this value smoker is, we really love its dual mode temperature controller. There's no need to debate whether you want the more precise control you get from a PID based system or the extra smokiness you get from either, this thing can do either. It's more flexibility and more control so you can cook just the way you like it. Set the temperature straight from the control panel or hook it up to your smartphone via the Wi-Fi. The Grilla Grills app is one of our favorites because the layout is so simple. It's really easy to use and we haven't had any connectivity issues. You also get one meat probe thrown in to cook to temp without needing to buy a separate probe. Thanks you for watching guys, I hope you liked this video if this video is helpful to you. Please make sure like comment and subscribe, if you have any question related to this product you can leave a comment down below. I will get back to you as soon as possible.